hello. Now, I tried to research this, but you're going to find my ignorance in seeds. And you think, why are you talking to us about seeds and planting seeds? Well, there's a very good reason why. Um, I would, as I've been working on my compassion and having compassion towards others um, and not judging them, like, like we talked about, right? That um, part of having compassion is not judging them. I started thinking about um, sometimes when we have compassion or we believe we're trying to have compassion, um, we want a different outcome. If that makes sense, like let's, um, so let's say we have compassion towards our child who, um, put off doing their homework and, and instead of, you know, instead of getting mad and angry, you step back from the situation and you think about it and you think, well, they have had, you know, what maybe it's, you know, been very busy in band or very busy in theater or school or, you know, it's just the holiday seasons. There's been a lot of Christmas parties, you know. And so then you 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 think in in your way of not judging that they've been done something so horrible, you go, okay, maybe I can help them. You know, maybe I can see from their point of view, right? So that's compassion. Well, what happens when you have compassion? And then they don't either accept it or they don't appreciate it, right? So that's where it goes to the seeds. That's what has got me thinking about seeds. So if I planted pumpkin seeds and I just wanted more than anything for that to grow into a squash. Now a pumpkin may be a squash again. Just stay with me here. <laughs> so if you did that, <clears throat> no matter what you did, no matter what you did, that seed will grow into what's inside of it, what it is naturally. No matter what I do, I cannot change that seed. It doesn't matter how I water it. It doesn't matter how I plant it. It doesn't matter if I plant it in different areas, in different soils. And so each person is their own seed that God, that he created. And Sometimes we try to change each seed. And we try to, maybe we have a child that's very um, artsy and we want them to be athletic. We're trying to change their seed. So I just, in thinking about compassion and thinking about not judging, we also need to remember that everybody Everybody is different. And that we, can, we can't change who they are. Or maybe their talents. Maybe they're talented in one area and not in another. Or we want them to be talented in one area and they just don't want to be. And that's where we don't, <clears throat> that's where kind of the judging comes in, where we shouldn't judge others because we don't know. There's so much we don't know that we are here to live on faith, right? Right? How much does it talk about faith over and over and over again in the scriptures? And for us to have faith, that's hard. We won't have all the answers. Now, I know that there are people who believe they do have all the answers. And if someone ever tells you they do, <laughs> I would be wary of them. Because we're here to live by faith. And we're here to trust in the Lord that he, that 
seeds are created different. And he knows exactly where to plant us and where to put us. And it's trusting in him and trusting that, that maybe we need to move to help our children grow. But we also need to remember our kids are independent. Our family members, everybody, we're all different seeds, all of us. And so it's turning to the Lord and realizing God, what, what do you want me to do? Where do you want me to grow? How do you want me to grow? And trusting in him and having faith. And having faith that other seeds grow different ways. Other seeds grow in different places. And that's where the compassion and judging, not judging comes in. It's realizing that not everybody has to be like you or do things your way. Absolutely not. That God loves all his children, all of them. Every single one of them. So I hope this helps you because I know it has helped me a lot in trying to love my neighbor, my family, my friends, all of those around me. I hope you all have an absolutely wonderful, wonderful week. Thanks. Thank you so much for watching or listening to my podcast. You can find more podcasts or videos at perfectlypattytalks.com or you can search me up on Facebook or Instagram at Perfectly Patty. Thanks again.